A couple of weeks ago, I took a video of a couple of the projects. The um, uh, what was it? The uh, rain capture system and my fence, and I was just building these flower beds. Well, here's about about a month later. Here's the results of the flower bed. All right. This one one has the uh, garlic and onions just coming up and hopefully you can see those put a little fence and some netting around it to keep the birds and animals out and then uh, here's the main part these are my collard greens nice luscious collard green this is a couple about a month a month and a half at the most of uh, growth I'm really pleased with it. The uh, compound again that I used was, what the compost was, uh, um, mushroom compost. Worked out really well. Very proud of what's going on here in this flower bed. Actually built like a, turned out to be more like a greenhouse. And over here, over here we've got uh, mainly Chinese cabbage. And on that far side over there is the uh, color or the uh, mustard greens. And I've got some, some beautiful, wonderful, lush vegetation going on here. Just really, really, really pleased with what's going on here. You know, just big green leaves. Beautiful. See, they're coming together to form the head. And. Uh, harvest a few of these for maybe for dinner tonight and I'm really proud I probably came out really well and uh, Chinese cabbage over there collard greens again it's really nice really lush green healthy you know what's been put on it can you believe they claim that uh, the people preferred uh, to have GMO unlabeled food in California proposition uh, 30 Seven was defeated. Can you believe that crap? And then some more political har harangering. All right, and this over here is my are my onions on this half. No, this is my garlic over here. And then my onions over here on this side. And they're coming along really nicely. Really proud of them. Very nice. And I also I come out here and I harvest the leaves. The leaves are just like onions. I mean, you don't have to wait on the bulbs. The, the garlic, I mean, it's garlic and onions, just like leaves. I mean, just like onions and garlic. The leaves are just like onions and garlic. And over here is my spice box. Um, getting turned away from the sun here. And there's my spice box. I've got uh, my uh, sweet mint. And then here's my peppermint. And over here my onion cloves. And rosemary. Growing nicely. And down at that other end is the uh, oregano. So we've got a nice oregano going on down there. So I'm very pleased with how this came out. And towards the summer I'll build two more boxes over here in this area so I'll have a total of two four six seven of them and over here my my lemon tree that uh, every year has been producing humongous lemons Isn't that, isn't that a beauty I squeezed down I think about four bottles of uh, lemon juice so far these are a lot of big beautiful lemons I love this tree has been very productive very very productive more lemon tree more lemons They're all over the place so yeah, big thorns though golly big thorns So I'm real pleased with how this came out. This is the first time I've done this 
and uh, so that came out really well. Come back around this side, and, uh, and of course I have the option of covering this over with uh, clear plastic to make it a maybe a true greenhouse. But I'm going to keep it off as long as I can. Big leaves, that's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful leaves. A cabbage uh, and mustard greens. Really good. Rain capture system. I said, well, I'm going to get mine now before they try to pass the law in this country or in this state <coughs> outlawing the capture of rainwater. <coughs> and over here, I put my smoker and my uh, grill. Got a new. Uh, from Brunfeld, B R A U N F E L S. -S. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Man, pepper's getting to me. Um, wonderful smoker. I really like the smoker. That's really good. I like that smoker a lot. So we've got the, this hog and some. Uh, take a peek in there. Some hog and uh, <coughs> some fish and trout that we caught last night in there. Close it back up. And there's my area for my other garden. Those are the remainders of the. Uh, there's still a couple of. Uh, um, darn. You call it. Um, <coughs> uh, uh, shoot, I can't think of the word of it right now, so. Uh. All right. Oh, and then over here, again, one of my projects was when I made this uh, rain filtration, emergency rain filtration or water filtration. And this bucket has the uh, filter in it, percolated down into this bucket. <coughs> kind of based on the Berkeley uh, concept, the Berkey uh, water filter concept. So everything's coming out pretty good. I had a wonderful day of fishing yesterday with my son from Texas and. Caught a bunch of trout and a uh, um, couple of uh, really nice bull red, 30 and 31 inches. Unfortunately, we had to throw them back. So, anyway, just want to get this on, <coughs> get this recorded. Got something choking and tickling my back of my throat. Apologize for that. All right, take it easy. Bye bye.